by Jerry Tsuwai. Feeds this scrum back to Revolvo. And here's Randrandra again. Money he's around the outside. Semi Randrandra. He's got his Toulon teammate to his left, but he won't need him. Look at Randrandra go. 15 to go. Can he get there? Douglas on the chase. He scores. Randrandra showing world class stuff here at Rugby HQ. We're talking about it and executing it as two very different things. Semi Randrandra has been absolutely a superstar over the course of this weekend. The crowd has been in there early. And look at him go to work here. There is nothing on. He stands up. Pat K, hands down, still has Justin Douglas coming across the beat. He hits the angle. Douglas comes again, who has no slouch, but Randrandra has a look back and scores it. He is a freak. Rupert Carl down here, the north right now that ball's been tapped back Backwards. in the Fiji direction advantage oh, Canada oh, that's Fiji look at Tua Solva just throwing off Harry Jones there with his big left arm they got the penalty and they go quickly Fiji looking for their second try here three straight wins on day one show and go and offload Ranasina Kula just checks back here on the near side for left out shoves him to the floor Randrandra Sets up a ruck. Here's Jerry Tua. Revolvo across the Tua Solva. Tua Solva with the bump, but he is brought down. Play on. Play on is the call from the referee. Moffin Thangi. Stretches those long legs. Puts it down under the posts. Canada doing everything they possibly can to try and bring down these big feet chains, but it's two tries to nil right now already. It's the physicality that really sticks out for mine though, Rupert. Led by Tui Solva. With runs like that, it just flows through your team. Unfortunately, he couldn't take it, Connor Braden. Morthan Othangi just so aware. Yeah, Canada down here just seriously getting animated. Damien Garrard frustrated because they see the likes of people like Connor Braden make superb tackles. I mean, Tui Sobi's a man mountain, but they just don't know how to stop this Fijian frenzy. Look at him just throwing people all over the place, Tui Sobi. Going to be a long day for Canada. Connor Bray, as you see, does extremely well there. Ollie Phillips, just unlucky they could not. Here come Fiji off the restart. It's Moffin Athangi already with a try in this game. Finds the offload, finds Dranesine Kula. And Fiji strike first in the second half. Gareth Baber demanded a lift from his players. Looks like he's got it. He asked for two things. Win the kickoff, score first. They did exactly that with 30 seconds gone on the clock. You can't do much more than that, Ollie. Yeah, and with that there, KT, on the sideline, you could just see Damien McGrath's shoulders just go down from a Canadian perspective. Just the thing he didn't want. As soon as half-time comes, Fiji just launch back into it. And God, when they get going, they are breathtaking, aren't they? That's the thing that really breaks your heart. You've worked so hard to scrape yourself back into the game before the half-time. Strong man. Into the hands of Jerry Tuwai, here he goes. So hard to put down is Veramalua, the jazz man, Jasa Veramalua. There's the offload over the top. Bounce pass and they're through again. It's Kalioni Nasoko this time. That's their fourth try. Fiji on the way to the semi finals. Oh, they just make it look so effortless, don't they? Kalioni Nasoko just clocks up another five pointer, but it came from defense once again. Challenging at the breakdown, getting numbers there. That's a real feature of their game in recent times. And then numbers in and around the ball, carrying the ball just so effortlessly. Look at that. I'll just pop it out the back door. Someone will be there, you know. It's going to be number three, Nassau. Oh, and what I love too, KT, is just how they carry the ball. The circle, just one hand. If he's just casually just wandering down the street, carrying this in there all day long. They just make it look so easy. They're just underlying their favoritism in this game haven't won it since Mine. 2012 Set. here at Twickenham so it's gonna be very tough for some team to stop this juggernaut here's a Ronnie Sow 
Shortlist of for rookie of the year. There's the offload to Nassila Lassila. Over the top. Oh, look at that. Champagne late in this quarterfinal party to Fiji. That's lovely to watch. Just a Veramalua. Well, if you like Sevens Rugby, you will love this try. Just sums up everything about the game. Just a Veramalua to sit back and watch this. This is absolutely outstanding from Fiji. Great scrum piece. They go out to the far side, the step, the pass out the back door. But you know what? I'll put another step in on the wrap round. I'll give it that pass as well. Ollie Phillips, good luck stopping that. Here comes Matt Mullins. Scored the opening try in the Singapore Sevens Cup final a couple of years ago, which Canada went on to win. Nice run down the far side that time from Savanovic. He finds the offload, but that's gone to deck. And here come Fiji again. This is the final play. Veramalu has got it in his hands. Back to Nasila Silla. Oh, this is glorious stuff. Noni Nasila Silla will run away. How on earth do you stop this team in this kind of mood? They are simply something else. Batemu Rovovo is the one who's going to get the score. I thought Canada very unlucky not to finish this game with a second try, but just the ability to chuck defence into attack. I mean, that's one of the passes of the weekend. How about the year? You just can't help but just applaud this now. Fiji are looking so formidable. Any team that stops them this weekend, I am not betting against. They are unbelievable. What an offload. What a result.